I learned how to golf at a very young age, but only more recently have I decided to get serious. On a recent trip to Bermuda, I decided to play nine holes at Belmont Hills Golf Club. Come along with me as we take a look at the course and give it a review. I'm gonna try to play around here at Belmont Hills Golf Club here in Bermuda. And you know what? We might try to make a little course vlog out of this. Just playing nine holes this morning. An adventure in itself. I was just walking from the hotel here, but very friendly people. So let's go get checked in, get our clubs. Belmont Hills Golf Club sits in the south end of Bermuda, overlooking what's called Great Sound or the Harbor. This course is 18 holes. I unfortunately was only playing nine holes today, and I was playing the front nine, which didn't offer that many harbor views, but I believe the back nine does. The course unfortunately does not offer a driving range, and since I was using a rental set of club and an amateur golfer, I took a breakfast ball. Second drive is pretty good, just a three wood. This course is gonna be really fun, I think, today. I'm all by myself, so it's not gonna really be a course vlog. I just wanna kind of review the course, but so far it's been pretty fun. The course overall was in really good shape. After hole one, you go under the tunnel and you complete the rest of the front nine. The course played about 6,000 yards from the blue and about 5,200 yards from the red. This meant that since I was playing from the white tees, if I hit a good drive in the middle of the fairway, I usually had a pretty short approach shot in. Let's go ahead in real time and play the par three seventh together. Got about 120 yards here on this par three. Should be a standard pitching wedge. So I'm gonna point it right at the pin and you're gonna watch the ball go in the hole. The ball landed kind of right there. Gotta try to get up and down for par. Which I did. Only a mile and a half wide, the island of Bermuda has some interesting geography, which can both help you off the tee and makes for some pretty tricky uphill putts. Bermuda is home to six golf courses, including the Port Royal Golf Course, which gets a PGA Tour event every year. As I make my way under the tunnel back to the ninth green, I wanna tell you about the price. It costs $60 to play nine holes today and it was $30 for the rental clubs. Now, let's go on to the last tee. Nine. I'm just gonna go with the three wood, it's only like 317, and I have not hit that driver well. This three wood actually comes pretty handy. These rental clubs, some tailor made RBZs, pretty good rental clubs. I think the putter might be a junior putter, but this has been a blast. I'm really happy I got away just for nine holes. Last hole, it's been a nice drive here. Come on, let's get a birdie. And that's how it should be. Save my best drive for the last one. And this has been a lot of fun. If you guys are liking this, please make sure to subscribe. And if you want to see more golf stuff, please comment below. I might start either a golf channel or doing some more golf content, especially on vacation. Because look at this. You can't beat golf like this. So thanks for coming to the adventure. We'll see how the hole ends up. We'll play for a birdie, maybe even a par. But until next time, enjoy your adventure. As I line up my putt here on the ninth, I want to say thanks first to my wife for taking our son for the morning so I could get out to golf and also to Belmont Hills Golf Course. Had a blast playing it. If you're in Bermuda, I think this is a wonderful place that you need to check out. Unfortunately, I missed the birdie putt, but I was able to tap in for par. Until next time, 